right, this is how I solo Lotus as Beast Tamer. Okay, so Lotus in P1 is pretty nice. If you don't have that much damage, you can just spend your burst here. But um, because of all the damage reduction from hammers and champ charge, you can just walk through the lasers like it's no big deal. So yeah, that's pretty nice. Um, for P2 and 3, there's uh, a technique. Well, it's a bit of an explanation how I how I dodge his punches. So there's three ways you can dodge his punches. You can dance on the edge of um, of Lotus's punch range, bait him into punching, and then you know walk out. Um, but that's not always available, so that's why I also do the other two strategies. The other strategy you can do is to just stand on top of him and uh, and just move behind him when he punches like this. Uh, yeah, I kind of did it right there. Um, and the third strategy is if you guys are both like kind of sandwiched in a corner you can just uh oh shoot oh shoot i'm grieving <laughs> i got away with it um if you're like sandwiched in a corner the punch doesn't like interrupt your hammer so you can just like let him beat you into the corner uh, but usually you don't want to do that for too long because you do lose a lot of DPS because he stuns the, stuns you a lot, uh, or the debris falls on you and you know bonks your head. Um, yeah, uh, when platforms fall, try to react immediately by flying or you know uh, hovering in the air with blink. Um, because it does take time to swap to hawk mode and you never know when you could start getting chain stunned so um, yeah, I'm try I try to give the uh, platforms as much advanced notice as possible we don't have any like form of super stance except for fly so you can't really just like get on the platform and agree to dps So I can't get too close to him because of all the debris, so that's when I wouldn't try to like do the moving behind him tactic. So yeah, it's all about your spacing and where the debris is currently falling that dictates which uh, of the three strategies to use. Whether it's dancing on the edge of his punch range, standing right on top of him, or letting him beat you into the corner. By the way, when you're uh, when you're reacting to platforms by flying, you can also greed a damage in tornado as well. Uh, just keep in mind that it's probably gonna get canceled pretty quickly uh, when a debris falls on your head. So it's not gonna be like that amazing, but it is still extra damage during a pattern when you're usually just kind of play it out. Alright, this has been Lotus.